So I found a new online math program that you can use for a complete homeschool math curriculum. I'm not even sure if it's new, but I hadn't heard of it before. It's called Math Academy, and it's an adaptive online math program for kids in fourth grade through high school that even includes college level math courses. It's a really interesting online math curriculum, so let's get started and review the Math Academy online math program together. I have to admit, I was really surprised to find this math program. I really thought I knew them all at this point, but I just happened across it and I thought, why not give it a try? I didn't know what to expect because there wasn't a whole lot of information on their website. And when you join, it says join beta. So I figure that it must be newer. But from what I tested, it definitely felt like a complete program. I was also surprised to learn that it's a fully accredited math program. Usually only a school can be accredited, so this is not something that you're normally going to find. And because of the adaptive learning and AI used in the program, you can learn math up to four times faster than you would in a traditional classroom. Math Academy is for students in fourth grade and beyond, and they recommend that kids know their multiplication tables through the 12s, and also that kids are able to read independently before they begin the program. This is a standards aligned math program, so you can expect that the courses will cover the same topics and at the same grade levels that they would in a traditional school, although this program does probably go above and beyond what would be taught in a typical public school. In addition to the fourth and fifth grade math courses, they also cover pre-algebra, algebra one, geometry, algebra two, pre-calculus, integrated math, SAT and ACT prep courses, AP calculus, mathematical foundations courses for adult learners, and several college level math courses. So there is a lot of content and this might be really great, especially for homeschooling families when your kids start to get older and you're not as comfortable teaching those upper level math courses yourself. This is an online math curriculum that your kids are meant to do independently. So there will be minimal parent involvement other than just tracking your child's progress through the program. I had to pay $49 to test out the Math Academy program because there is no free trial, but it does mention that you can get a full refund if you cancel within the first 30 days. So the cost will be either $49 a month with the option to cancel at any time, or you can save a bit by purchasing a full year upfront for $499. And unfortunately, that cost is per student. So it's definitely on the more expensive side for a homeschool math curriculum, but keep watching because I think you might be surprised at the quality of this program. So when you sign up, you'll get a parent account to track your child's progress and your student will have their own login. And you'll also pick the course or grade level that you want your child to start with. You can change this later and there are also some other settings that you can adjust and I'll show you that a little bit later in the video. You'll also set a daily goal of how many experience points they should earn per day. You can change this later too. The setup is pretty simple and then once you're done, you'll get an email with the details of how your child can log in. To test out this program, I chose Algebra 2. And if you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I did major in math in college. But that was a long time ago and high school math was even longer ago, but I figured I would test myself and see how much I remembered. The program starts with a diagnostic test and I really like that they do this because the test will help determine what they already know and then they won't have to relearn that material. I took the diagnostic test and it was pretty long, but I did okay. So when you finish the test and actually begin the course, depending on how you did on the exam, you might start the course already having made some progress in it. So basically it's letting you test out a material that you already know. So once that test is done, here's the main learning dashboard. So you can see the course you're enrolled in up here and your percentage completed. You can hover over these for more details. Then you'll see an estimated completion date for the course based on what you've already done and the experience you're set to earn per day. 
So obviously the day will change if you end up getting less or more experience each day. You'll see your experience earned for the day and week here. And down below is a leaderboard type of a thing. And then on the right are the lessons you can work on. And down below are the lessons you've completed. So you can choose any of the lessons that are unlocked here to start learning. Just click start to begin the lesson. The lessons are all taught with text like this here. They remind me a lot of my old math textbooks, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. From what I've seen so far, the explanations are very straightforward and simple to understand. It's been a long time since I've looked at this kind of math stuff, but I was able to understand these lessons just fine. It was actually a great refresher for me. I really enjoyed it. So you'll have an explanation and then some examples to look over, and then you'll get a chance to try some problems yourself. Whether you get the question correct or not, you'll be given a complete explanation of the problem. So I think that's really helpful. And if you keep getting questions wrong, it will actually stop the lesson. And then I noticed that when that happened, the lesson was not available to try again. So I'm assuming it will come back once I've covered some other topics. If you do well in the lesson, you'll get experience points. And if you do really well and get all the answers right, you'll get bonus points. So that's the learning format on Math Academy, at least from what I've seen from testing it out for Algebra 2. And before I give you my opinion on the program, let me just show you the parent dashboard and some of the settings that you can change. So to get to the parent dashboard, you just log out and then log back in with the email and password you set it up with. So you can see some information here like course progress, last activity, and experience earned. Then if you click on settings here and go down to course, this is where you can change the course for your student. You can also set it to holistic mode here. This mode will require your child to take a supplemental diagnostic test. And then your child will be given lessons to help with any gaps in their knowledge from lower level courses, even if it doesn't pertain to the course they're currently assigned to. There's also a test prep mode here. And here is a clean slate mode, which may be helpful if your child is using a course as a refresher to prepare for an exam. And you can set an end date that you want the course to be completed by here. You can also have your child retake the diagnostic test here, which will not erase their progress, but will update their progress if they've either forgotten material or made progress outside the program. Under XP goals, you can change the daily experience point goals. Under accommodations, you can allow additional time for assessments. You can also add another parent account here. Under documentation, you can request a transcript, progress report, or activity log. These will be emailed to the address you select within a few minutes or less. They will include a letter grade for the course too, which I know a lot of parents like to see. And if you end up not liking this program and want to cancel your subscription, you can do that here. So that's everything I wanted to show you today about the Math Academy online math program. So now is the part of the video where I give you my honest opinion about the program. And from what I've seen, I really like it. I know it may look a little bit dry compared to some of the other programs that I've reviewed on my channel, but it definitely looks like the real thing as far as curriculum goes. It's really just like having a textbook, except this textbook is smart and can figure out what you already know and skip over it. I found it really easy to follow the way that text was worded and the practice problems that follow the lesson were directly related to the lesson, which I really appreciate. And I just love that the program is adaptive. It's really so awesome how we can use technology today to save time and help people learn faster. There's really no reason to make students go over material again and again when they've already mastered it. It's just so much better to be able to focus on exactly what you need to learn. And it's self-paced, so you can take as long as you need to really master the material, or you can move through it quickly if you want to complete the course faster than you would be able to in a traditional school. I'm also quite impressed to find an accredited online math program. Usually accreditation only applies to schools, not curriculums. But I guess this is just one of those rare cases that are actually becoming more common where an online program also has received accreditation. 
So that's really cool. And it probably explains why Math Academy is a little bit more expensive than some of the other online math programs out there. So do I recommend Math Academy to use in your homeschool? Absolutely. I really didn't find anything wrong with it when I was testing it out. I don't think you'll go wrong with choosing this program, especially if you have a student who's good with independent learning. I also think it would be a great way for homeschool parents to refresh their knowledge in any particular course before teaching it to their child. And if you have kids in school or are using another math curriculum, this could be a really great study tool or something to help identify if your kids have any gaps in their knowledge on a particular subject. I also think it would be great to help kids study for the math portion of the SAT or ACT. If you have any questions on Math Academy or just a general question for me, let me know in the comments and I will be happy to answer. And if you found this video helpful, please consider letting me know by either leaving me a comment or clicking the like button. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.